guys, if you're looking for Madden Ultimate Team coins at some of the cheapest prices on the market, make sure you check out my new sponsor, utnfl.com, and use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 5% discount. Hey, what is going on, guys? Clickwood here, back again with another Madden 17 Ultimate Team Egg Rush update for you guys. Today is April 13th, which is a Thursday. And guys, it's the second day of the eggs opening up. So let's not waste any time. Let's hop into it and see what was inside of the eggs today. The first one that we have here is a silver egg, 413. Again, guys, all these silver eggs look pretty much identical. So uh, I'm assuming that they're pretty much going to be the same thing each and every day. Yesterday was a chocolate bunny and then also a uh, quick sell. And today as well, a chocolate bunny and also a quick sell. So you see on the right there that uh, that, that specific quick sell does have the Egg Rush logo on it. But they're pretty much going to only be, I believe, up to 1,000 coins. You might be able to find one that's 2,000 coins, but still really not a whole lot of value in those, unfortunately. So let's move on to the gold eggs. The first one that we have here is the green and gold, or the golden green egg, as it says on the bottom. Again, 413. And inside of this one was a 92 overall Quincy Anunwa who was definitely a player who broke out this year. You see the attributes there on the back. Six foot two is a pretty decent height for a wide receiver, but his attributes, they don't really stand out in any specific area, to be honest with you. I mean, he's not terrible anywhere. I guess his route running is kind of ugly, but he's not particularly great anywhere either. So this card's already going for about 9,000 coins. Really not a whole lot of value there. The next one, gold and burgundy. This one, a lot of people thought was going to be a season stars item or a season stars pack of some sort and when it revealed today it indeed was a season stars pack so there you have it season stars pack these i, I forget what they were going for i want to say fifty thousand coins but i could be wrong on that it might be way less than that too i'm trying to remember it might be like thirty thousand. but either way they were extremely overpriced in the game when they were in the game and they're still really not much in terms of uh, coming out of stuff coming out of them, to be honest. So let's move on now to the elite eggs. The first one, this purple and gold egg, was one of the more rare ones that came out in the whole promo. And inside of that gift or that egg was a 97 overall Eric Weddle. Probably one of the better things that we're going to get out of this whole promo, to be honest with you. 97 overall. Now, take a look at his attributes here. I don't think this card is the best like it's not bad I mean certainly it has some value but I think the 97 overall is a little deceiving because I don't really think it's particularly amazing anywhere now granted it does have good acceleration at a 95 and its zone coverage is very good at a 96 but overall it doesn't really have some of the things that we would love it to have like the huge hit power the huge speed the great tackling like I don't know it's just not that spectacular there so unfortunately a little bit disappointing on that but still a 97 overall safety so we'll definitely take that beggars can't be choosers in this promo and last but not least we had the the one that was kind of like the gold and brown colors and this one was inside of it exactly what we kind of expected that it was going to be and that was a signature pack now Signature packs definitely are something that is valuable. I mean, these cards are fairly rare and they have some 95 overalls now. So these are definitely something where you can pull some really good stuff. Unfortunately, there was a problem when this whole promo dropped today, when the, when the eggs revealed. And uh, unfortunately, the people that were opening the eggs early in the day did not even have the opportunity at getting like the new 95 Andrew Luck and things like that. They actually could only pull 88s. And uh, so we got a response from Jake Stein, who is one of the EA producers for Madden Ultimate Team content. And I apologize, Jake, if I got your title wrong there. But uh, Jake's one of the very best guys on the Madden team, in my personal opinion. He does a great job of getting back to everybody in the community. And somebody asked, why are people pulling 88s from the signature pack that came from an elite egg? It appears to be that there are no 95s at all. So he just asked... Or he just responded and said, I just asked the team. It was a mistake on our end. They're working to fix the pack and we'll make it right for the people who already opened it. So there you have it there. I mean, Jake Stein getting back to us pretty quickly on it, admitting their mistakes. I mean, these things do happen. We get it. But 
unfortunately it's just like another one of these things in the crazy long list of errors that have happened this year so a little bit disappointing on that but it does seem like the people who did open that pack earlier in the day and pulled an 88 are going to get some sort of redemption for a higher overall player so with that said, guys, that is going to do it for this video. Hopefully, you guys learned something. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the eggs today. I think we got some good stuff, but I'm still holding out hope that we're going to get something really amazing in one of these eggs. So, again, guys, make sure you stop on back, drop a like, and subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.